What's going on you guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be playing Enter the Gungeon. If you guys haven't seen this game, there's a lot about it. Uh, this is not a new game, it's a pretty old game, but we're going to go and get right on into it. So, we got the Hunter, we have the Convict, we have the Pilot, and we have the Marine. Now, I like the Hunter. Um, I've played this game previously, not on this channel, but I have played this game. We're going to start off with the... Uh, let's start off with the Marine. Marine's always a good start off point. So, need to get used to the controls, so we walk around like this. And then we can dodge roll with the B. Okay, that sounds right. Stuck you. Well, what do we have here? You must be a new arrival. Let me guess, here to change the past, right? Well, you're not the first. But there's no salvation here. I was like you once, came to change the past. And now I have no future. All right, let's go in here. This should be the tutorial, I believe. Halls of Knowledge. Wayward soul, approach me and press A to speak. For it is I, Sir Manuel. Heed my words and I shall show you how to survive this accursed labyrinth. Continue through this door to begin your tutelage. All right. Try flipping these tables or kicking with those A buttons. Yeah, get angry! Excellent interacting people. Proceed to the next room. This is the most important lesson. You can dodge roll by pressing LB in any direction. You're invulnerable to gunfire in the first half of the dodge roll, but vulnerable again when you hit the ground. This means you can dodge through bullets and hazards. It requires precise timing. When you give the word, I'll open the barrier. Use the dodge roll to reach the other side without parachaining. Wait until the last second and begin. Ready! Yeah, that ain't hard to do. Nice work. Thank you, Sir Manuel. And then pass. Use your dodge roll to jump over the pit. Easy. Easy. The door's open, but you've got to last pit to cross. Time it well. What's over here? Do I have to speak to you? The dodge roll is the first step and the best way to avoid dying in a gunfight. Sometimes, though, the number of bullets can be overwhelming. For instance, there's no dodge to do that, but there is a way to clear the path. These are called blanks. Using one will delete all enemy projectiles in the room. Stop enemies from shooting for a short period. They will also push nearby enemies away. Great if you need a second reposition. Now, pick them up and walk over them. So, we're going to pick these up. Use blanks by pressing L at the same time. Use a blank to clear the way of the bullets. Right, so we... Boom. Excellent! Blanks refill every floor, so use them when you need to. They can also be found throughout the gungeon, but I wouldn't rely on that. Onward! Okay. Now what, Sir Manuel? You've got the basic stuff, guy. I suppose you've earned a reward. A gun befitting your stature and experience. Go on, open it. Pea shooter! Wow. I feel one of the gun's natural inhabitants. Cruel, savage, and bloodthirsty. Uh oh. Now. Kill him! Boy, you ain't getting away from me. Alright, so how do I fire? Uh, oh, it's just, okay. I'm gonna have to change his controls, I think, but that makes sense. Cold-blooded truly, you are ruthless. The next rooms will be real gunfights. Kill all the enemies in each room, and the doors will open. I'll meet you a few rooms ahead. Now go. Alright, we got the pea shooter. Okay. We got hit. We lost our shield for that. Be sure it kind of sucks, y'all. Come on. Boom, baby. Whoa. <laughs> Over here. You made it. You know how to dodge roll, shoot, and use blanks, but there's more to learn. You need to know how to use items that don't exist in gun form. This med kit, for example, will replenish your health. Pick it up by approaching it. You got plenty of health now, don't use it yet. But when you think you need it, jam the RT button and use it. Okay, head on through. Thank you. You see that thing on the other side? That's a teleporter. Whenever you find one, you can always return there as long as you aren't in combat. To use it, first open the map by holding LT and select it. Got it? Got it. Alright, so we teleport like this. Okay, did I just... Yeah, I lost a health point too, doing that. 
Remember, you can just work on your teleport, not just the same room, but they won't work if they're in combat. If you use A while standing on you can teleport back to where you were. The way in few is dwarf. You should try to explore. Okay. What is this? I don't know. Okay, let's keep going. So remember, we can, you can use the tables. Yep, so you can use a table because the other one blew up. They knock them up too, which is really odd. But they can do the same thing. Shotgun. This weapon's not as good as the starter weapon for the Marine, but it's fine. So this is like a real run right now where we're actually like, you know, going through the floors. So it's not real. It's fake. This game can get very difficult. There's a free blank. Love that. Love to see it. We got two blanks right now also, which is great. Let's go right. Maybe we'll find some chests. Rambo uses AK. So see that? We can dodge roll like that. I'm decent at this game. It's been a very long time since I've played, but I'm decent. Also, the controls are very wonky with this game. I played it on Xbox, so playing on PC is very odd. Ooh! If you need, if you hold two or more guns, hold Y to slow time and pick the ones you want. Why switch guns? Yo, we got AK-47! Look at that, that's pretty good. All right, so that opens up there. You can actually just straight up. Wait, what? That teleports me. Huh, okay, that's a thing. There's the boss room. Let's go. Speak with me when you're ready for the final challenge. You ready to put all you've learned to test? Let's do it, then face me in single combat. All right. Let's begin. I'm not scared of you, Sir Manuel. Okay. Maybe a little. Come on, fight me, boy. Boom! Cease fire! Cease fire! Peace shooter unlocked. You've bested me. I, the great Manuel. So long as I ruled these halls, only to be undone by the likes of you. Heads money credit. Ex unlock Gungeon Acolyte. Complete the tutorial. The reign of Sir Manuel. Master of the Gungeon ends unceremonially. You've done it. You beat the entire game. Leave me to die. Again. Uh, uh. Go on. Take some of those bullets for Blockner. Blockner? So is that like... I'm back. Who are you? Enter co-op now. Okay, so we can switch characters. Oh, I, have you seen that misguided spirit, Sir Manuel? He's stuck in these halls last. Sad, really. Ha ha. Wait, no, I don't want to go back in here, do I? No. I've already done this. I don't want to do it again. No, thank you. All right, what else can we do in this? So what's up here? Looks like we gotta unlock that. If I remember correctly, that's the elevator. That's the elevator. We got 10 hedge money credits, by the way, which is great. What else is there around here? That's blocked off. Two guards, apparently, and then that's also blocked off. What do you have to say? The Gungeon awaits, tough guy. You're now ready to enter the Gungeon. All right, let's do it. Do as the name implies, enter the Gungeon. Hmm. Keep of the Lead Lord. A shrine to an old gunslinger. There's an inscription. Kill your past. You've already damned your future. The rest is worn away. Huh. Alright, well this is the first floor, so let's let's do this. I'm excited. Alrighty. See how it's going, boys. Sniping, sniping. <laughs> Going here. There's all the enemies. This is a clear room, I guess. Nice. Don't mind if I do. Woo! Let's open that. I had a fuse, so it was gonna explode. Heart of ice. That's cold. Check out what that is. Whoa. Peace shooter, I joined the shootout. Dope. Alright, heart of ice. It's right here. Fire ice projectiles on taking damage. The icy heart was torn from a mighty frost giant, a common target for talented monster hunters. 
So fire ice projectiles and pop Not bad. Okay, that's the better way to open the Anon card. I thought there was a better way. Okay. Cool. Keep going. You fools. You think you can defeat me? I'm gonna go the whole floor without taking a single hit of damage, because that's how good I am. What is that room? There we go. Mindful of the explosions, of course. There we go. What is this about? Statues, I guess. You can knock these over and they'll burn. Not sure why you'd want to do that, though. Keep going. Ghosts. Oh, I don't like the ghosts. Ghosts are kind of annoying. Woo! There we go. Let's go left. Oh, there's a the boss. Let's not go left. Let's go right. Okay. There's a blue guy. There's also a ghost. Uh-huh. Okay. Come on, you're so dead. Yeah, you are. Oh, oh! I got hit! Oh, look at the frozen fractals everywhere. I, mean, I really thought I was going to be able to do that without getting... Oh, I hate you. Alright, let's wait. Boom. Hide. You can actually dash through it too, but it's not worth it. Go. Look at that, we got a blank for that. Okay, cool. Blank, banish bullets. Okay, so the birds don't actually fire bullets if you don't shoot them immediately. Something to watch out for. There we go. So they'll explode in the bullets. Alright. So far, so good. We're doing really well clearing the first floor, but it's usually the first floor that's the easiest. So, you know. The game does get gradually more difficult, as all roguelikes do. But you also get gradually better. You get better guns, you get better experience. I don't think you can actually beat this game on the first playthrough. I don't think that's possible. Okay, we need another key here. You can also break down chests for junk, uh, and there's a chance to get junkin. I don't know if you have to unlock him, or if he's just automatically given, but let's see if we can do that. Huh? Boom. Boom, baby. This need a water tank, you can actually do that, but I don't think we can do that yet. We have to defeat the Lich first. So, huh. I thought you could just do it, but you can't. Looks like it's locked. Need a key, you guys. Singular key. You'll notice that we just gradually gain money the more enemies we kill. So that's always a good thing to have. They can pull up tables, which is very smart of them. So there's one. You'll get better weapons in the game. They also are stun locked. Some enemies are stun locked and you keep shooting them. Here's a shop. Alright, so cigarettes are 35. A new gun, 35. I don't like t-shirt cannon. This guy, you give money to. Let's see if he said anything. Just smile face. Something for the collection? I will compensate you. So I can give him my items and he will give me um, money in return. So we can buy like cigarettes and things like that. We need a key, however. Let's buy the key. Thank you, sir. And then we need to go to the chest. What's that? Oh, that's a gun. That's the Invalian. I like the Invalian. So it's a charge up weapon. You shoot it, it shoots a giant anvil. Getting bouncy bullets and things like that with that is a very useful uh, item. All right, let's go to the left. So if we get a key from one of these, I'm going to be very upset. I'm going to be like, Bruh. switch weapons back. We can clear the floors with Marine and Sidearm. We only use the big weapons for uh, bosses. But it's ideally when you want to use it. You can wait. You also notice how there's a bunch of traps around. We have the explosive barrels, the chandeliers, things like that. You gotta be careful of. Whoa, okay. Huh? Where's the last enemy? There he is. That's locked. Woo! I don't know how you did not hit me with that. Wow. So I think that's every area on the map cleared. Double check that. It is. So let's go fight the boss. Uh, teleport. There we go. And we're going to go and reload our weapon. And we're going to pull out the Andalian. Alright, who's it going to be? I think it's Bullet King, right? Oh no, it's this guy. I don't like him. <laughs> he just 
flew off with a giant machine gun. <laughs> Gatlin Goal Rapid Fire Raptor. So he, yeah, see how he does rapid fire? That's literally his name. Okay, so if you can, uh, hit, uh, if you can kill a boss without getting any damage taken to you, you get extra um, thing. Obviously, I'm not gonna get that because I made a mistake. I could have just used this weapon. I don't know why I didn't. Okay, I don't like this one. This one shoots down bombs. I totally could have finished him though without getting any damage. That was a dumb move on my part. Getting hurt was so stupid. Oh my god, I got hurt again! Alright, let's just switch to Invalian. Let's just do it. Okay, come on. You gotta be so close, dude. Okay, that one splits. Not a fun one to deal with. Because it comes back. Where's he going? Where'd he go? There he is. He's so close. Come on. That's for your last hit. Yeah! Did it. There we go. Perfect. Alright, so we got a weapon in the middle. Stinger. Drone warfare. But we did not get the extra bullet thing, which is a hard container. So Stinger is the bomb with the bees, right? Yeah. I like this weapon. Cool. They just ate his body, by the way. Can we just talk about how dark that is? All right, so you click this guy. Hey, you're looking pretty beat up. You want to take a break and come later? Not this time. So you can save and quit each floor, which can be very useful, but we don't need to save and quit yet, so let's keep going. The Stinger's going to be a great weapon to use against the next boss, though. I like the Stinger. Stinger's a good weapon. Chamber 2! All right. Let's see the Stinger in action. Watch this. So it's a heat-seeking bee. It's a heat seek speed. Look how good that is. We don't want to waste our ammo on it. Though. Dude, how are you not dead? I tried you so many times. All right, now he's dead. All right. Oh yeah, this guy. Definitely don't like dealing with you. How unlucky are we to get him on the first floor or second floor? At least there's a big open room. Two stingers should take care of it. Yep. Bruh. Doing good. We got 102 monies. Oh, that marionette's annoying because there's heat seeks. As you can see. When it's open. No heat seek. All of its bullets on you. There you go. He's dead. But it's still he seeks. Literally the most annoying. Okay. Okay, I'm taking damage. Mayday, Captain. We're fine. Okay, yeah, you're annoying too. You teleport around and then blow up. Oh, ammo. So we can actually pick a weapon to get ammo back. Let's refill our Andalian. And a key. I love that. So you can get weapon upgrades for all your weapons, like bullet upgrades, but... I don't want to waste my ammo, so I'm using the stinger. We also have a item that calls ammo. Teleporting around the place. There we go. Perfect. Oh yeah, I know this one. Don't get in the middle of that. It explodes. It's like poison. Boom. We're clearing these floors though. Oh, the cube guys also explode like that. Wait, how did I run into that? I totally dodge rolled that. Oh, I guess if there's a second. Oh, that seemed a little unfair. Snipers will fire with quick and accuracy. Uh, that guy will summon shapes and letters and teleport around the place. Wow, okay. That's terrifying. I usually try to get the magicians out of the way first, because they can be very annoying, but uh, sometimes I just kind of like, you know, 
Okay. I find walls is a key element here in this game. Because, oh, you can also knock into the fist. I forgot about that. That worked out in my favor. <laughs> oh yeah, this guy, will, this bat, is annoying too. It summons a little, yeah. See how they they turn the bullets and the tower get you? Look at that. That just smacked him right in the butt. <laughs> Don't like the marionette. Really don't like the marionette. For that reason alone, I don't like the marionette. Hate the marionette, man. Oh, that's so annoying. You can also... S yeah, so we can switch weapons. Depending what you switch to or not. Okay. We have four keys, let's open this. Ooh, yes! Angry bullets, right? Scatter shot. So this will. Oh, that's good. So we won't have the ability to like aim as well, but you can literally. You have more bullets, and it works for all weapons, I believe. Oh, this is a uh, mini boss room. Crap. I was not preparing myself for this. Look at scatter shot go. Alright, you're dead. Bottle unlocked. Heck yeah, dude. Alright, let's grab that heart piece. And that's a key to unlock an NPC character. Cell key. What could it unlock? Let's open this with a key, too. That's an item. Explosive decoy. So you saw that little uh, blue arrow? That means it's synergized with something. What is it synergized with? Blue bottle's unlocked. It's synergized with our blue thing. Distracts enemies, even then explodes. And it seems to synergize with the ice projectile, so I'm assuming it will... Uh, How do I use my item? Um, hold on. Let me look and see. So if I did this correctly, it should be down on D-pad? Yeah. Okay, so look, it's ice. So it'll explode. Right? And then, yeah. Okay. Cool. Well, we're going to keep that one because this is a one-time use um, call. We're going to use it on our stinger weapon. And we're gonna grab the ammo crate for that. Thank you. All right, and it looks like there's actually a place to go down. So let's go this way. Oh, it's the boss. Okay, have we been everywhere? We have not. I see a lot of places we have not been. Should be two chest rooms. I think we've only found one. Keep going. Okay. Dang. Oh, what? Oh, I have to go around? Okay. A little annoying, but whatever. It's fine. Come on. Yeah. Awesome. Okay. Killing it. We're so close to death. Come on. Boom. Key. We've been getting a lot of keys. Oh, here we go. Here's a shop. Anything good? A uh, crossbow, a shield, ooh, prime primer. Let's buy it. Prime primer, old magic. If I remember correctly, bullet component. The primer is one of the first ever gar gun dead to ever walk the gungeon. It still trembles with the energies released when bullets struck. So primer is a good item to have because it doesn't seem like it does anything, but trust me, it does. So let's buy the armor also, so we get that helmet back on our head, and let's keep going. This should be a item room. It is. Let's open that. Ooh! Laser rifle. Whoa! Holy cow! Is that synergizing with my scatter shot? Oh, it totally is. Commonplace energy weapon. The laser rifle is the AK-47 of the future, known for its low manufacturing cost and lower maintenance requirements. The laser rifle is used throughout the galaxy by hunters and miscreants alike. That's a good weapon. Look at that. Holy cow, let's use that. Oh yeah, here we go. So this is where I use the key. You can unlock these people. Oh, finally! I knew it would be a while before someone came down here, but seriously? It's been forever! Anyway, we should get back to the shop. It's been closed for way too long. You should come by. We're on the top of the level of the breach. You can't miss it. Thank you for rescuing Mistress Candace and this one. I will escort her to the breach. Come on, Ox. 
Ugh, you're always so slow. The breach. <laughs> cool. And then we have this. The altar's empty. Right, so this is a secret path, but we can't actually do it yet until we unlock um, the thing, so. You been everywhere? Yes. All right, let's go fight the boss. Let's see how much damage this laser rifle does. If it doesn't do enough, we'll switch to the uh, stinger. The Beholder. I like him. The Beholster. Never mind, not Beholder. How much damage is that doing? It's decent. Um... I'm like... Okay, I used the... I used the thing. I panicked. I used the thing! I used the thing! I want to kill you without using... I want to get my... Yes! Yes! I did it! I didn't get hit once. I used two flanks, granted. But you'll see I got the uh, level 2 iron coin unlocked. Look, there it is. Whole baby. So that increases my heart containers, which is great. So we can actually pick up both of these. And then what's this? Cog battle. Active reload. So let's see what these both do. And we unlock that new item. So we got this. So this potion, potent artifact indicates mastery of the second chamber. Any who enter the gungeon are doomed to remain, living countless lives in an effort to break the cycle. Enables active reload. So this is active reload. What does that mean? Where's my... Oh, there it is. Yeah. I'm assuming that means I can fire. Wait, what? Oh, I can take not as long to reload. Okay. That's cool, I guess. Interesting. Huh. Okay. Cool. All right, you guys. Well, that's going to be it for the first video. If you like this, I'm going to definitely have a lot more. So let's go ahead and save and quit. All right, then. Quitter. Head down. On down to save. Ouch. Look at that. So, yes, we will be picking this back up again on floor level three, I believe. But, yes, this is a great game. Really enjoy it. I'm pretty decent at this game. You guys can see me. I'll do a lot of progress. I'm probably going to 100% the game. Whether or not I do it in recording or on my own is up to you guys and the amount of views we get on this channel. But I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.